Well, what should homeowners do if your plants are already coming up? Yeah. Scott Steele talked to an expert to ease any fears. March is already about six degrees above average, with plenty of 50s and even a 60 on the thermometer. And that's got some buds bursting. But the impending snow has some homeowners worried about what to do in their own yards when spring has already sprung. Probably that early 60 degree weather they teased us with here a couple weeks ago. You know, now we have some blooms and, you know, it'll be interesting to see what happens to them. Hopefully they'll survive. I hope so. Experienced horticulturalist Lorena Harrington and her team from Beautiful Blooms believe sometimes nature simply knows what to do. Yeah, snow is a great insulator for the plants, so even the crocus and the daffodils and tulips that have started to emerge from the ground, those are going to be well protected. If we happen to get a dive in the temperatures down well below freezing, then we might see a little bit of tip burn on those, but the flower buds themselves should be pretty safe. Nature knows what to do. It does. It's very smart. So with that issue off your mind, Harrington advises getting a head start on spring cleanup to ensure your own beautiful blooms by summer. So taking out any of the leaf debris, the dried plant material left from last season. Also, if you use rose cones or any winter protection, now is definitely the time to take that off. In fact, even though flakes may soon fly, these crews are working two weeks earlier than ever before. A testament to just how mild these last few months have been. And they'll be eager to get back to work as soon as any new snowfall melts. In Pewaukee, Scott Steele, today's TMJ4. Thank you very much, Scott. So the